Digital platforms in India have accelerated the anti-Muslim hatred that forms the architecture of hate crimes in India. In the name of free speech, misinformation and hatred are very easily able to flourish. Content circulating on digital platforms incites violence against Muslims in India. The report titled Experiences of Muslims in India on Digital Platforms with Anti-Muslim Hate found. Digital infrastructure of Hindutva is organized around building disinformation and accelerating the circulation of enmity and grudge against the Muslims. The narratives of hate are often centered on specific events and policy decisions made by the ruling BJP and diverging responses to Hindutva. Several right-wing and Hindutva leaders have been calling for a Muslim genocide. The lack of moderation policies by social media platforms against hate speeches have resulted as icing on the cake for the extremist BJP regime. Provocative speeches on social media circulated after the Citizenship Amendment Act became the law on 11th December 2019 and riots broke out in Delhi which killed as many as 53 people causing enormous damage to Muslims. On 1st January 2022, prominent Muslim women were put up for sale on an app on GitHub. In March 2020, COVID-related Islamophobic content expanded across digital platforms in India, suggesting that Muslims are responsible for the spread of the pandemic. Facebook's posts in India have always been flooded with inflammatory content that are linked to deadly religious riots. Activists and civil society groups have expressed deep concerns over Prime Minister Narendra Modi's and Home Minister Amit Shah's silence on the incidents, making it obvious that the hate speeches are fully backed by the BJP government.